our universe began with a burst of energy. This monumental event known as the Big Bang set the stage for everything we know today. In an instant the universe expanded from a singular point to an ever-growing expanse, filled with potential and mystery. From that chaotic inferno, elementary particles coalesced. These particles, the fundamental building blocks of matter, danced in a cosmic ballet, gradually forming more complex structures. Quarks combined to form protons and neutrons, which then joined to create the first atomic nuclei. These particles became the building blocks of atoms, stars, and galaxies. Hydrogen and helium atoms emerged, eventually giving birth to the first stars. These stars, in turn, forged heavier elements in their cores, seeding the universe with the ingredients for planets and life. Now, fast forward billions of years. The universe has evolved into a vast and complex tapestry of galaxies, stars and planets. On one small planet orbiting an average star, life has emerged and evolved to the point where it can ponder its own existence. At Fermilab, scientists have discovered a new particle, Zeta-9. This discovery is not just another addition to the particle zoo, it represents a potential paradigm shift in our understanding of the universe. This particle behaves unlike anything we have ever seen. Its properties are so unusual that they challenge the very foundations of particle physics. Scientists are meticulously analyzing its behavior, trying to understand its implications. Zeta-9 is extraordinarily sensitive to the human mind. Unlike other particles, it seems to respond to brainwave patterns, suggesting a connection between thought and matter that has never been observed before. It seems to defy the known laws of physics by interacting with our thoughts. This interaction is not just a minor anomaly, it could represent a fundamental shift in our understanding of reality itself. This discovery has shattered our existing understanding of the universe and our place within it. The scientific community is abuzz with excitement and skepticism as researchers around the world scramble to replicate and understand these findings. The implications of Zeta-9 are far-reaching, touching upon the very nature of consciousness and reality itself. If thoughts can influence particles, what does this mean for our understanding of the mind? Could consciousness be a fundamental aspect of the universe? This particle could be the missing link between the physical world and the realm of thought. Theoretical physicists are exploring the possibility that Zeta-9 could bridge the gap between the tangible and the intangible, offering new insights into the nature of existence. Imagine a world where thoughts are not confined to the brain but can influence the fabric of reality. This concept, once relegated to the realm of science fiction, is now being seriously considered by some of the brightest minds in science. Zeta-9 hints at this astonishing possibility. Its unique properties suggest that the boundaries between mind and matter may be more fluid than we ever imagined. Its discovery marks the beginning of a new era in scientific exploration. As we delve deeper into the mysteries of Zeta-9, we may uncover truths that will forever change our understanding of the universe and our place within it. The journey of discovery has just begun, and the possibilities are as boundless as the cosmos itself. The behavior of Zeta-9 is both fascinating and perplexing. This particle, unlike any other we have encountered, exhibits properties that challenge our fundamental understanding of physics and consciousness. In controlled experiments, this particle appears to anticipate human decisions. It's as if Zeta-9 has a window into the future reacting to choices before they are even made. Before a subject is even consciously aware of their choice, Zeta-9's behavior shifts. This preemptive reaction suggests a level of interaction between our minds and the quantum realm that is far more profound than we ever imagined. This suggests a connection between our minds and the quantum realm that is far more profound than we ever imagined. The implications of this discovery are vast and could potentially redefine our understanding of reality itself. Imagine a game of chance where Zeta-9's properties change based on your predicted choice even before you make it. This seemingly impossible scenario is the reality we face. The implications are staggering. This seemingly impossible scenario is the reality we face. The implications are staggering. If Zeta-9 can predict our choices, it raises questions about the nature of free will and determinism. Does Zeta-9 grant us access to a precognitive ability, or does it challenge our very understanding of free will? The discovery of Zeta-9 has overturned our classical view of cause and effect, or does it challenge our very understanding of free will? The discovery of Zeta-9 has overturned our classical view of cause and effect. It suggests that our thoughts, often viewed as intangible products of the brain, can influence the behavior of fundamental particles. 
The discovery of Zeta-9 has overturned our classical view of cause and effect. It seems that our thoughts, often viewed as intangible products of the brain, can influence the behavior of fundamental particles. This raises profound questions about the nature of consciousness and its role in the universe. It seems that our thoughts, often viewed as intangible products of the brain, can influence the behavior of fundamental particles. This raises profound questions about the nature of consciousness and its role in the universe. Are we merely observers in a predetermined reality or do our minds play an active role in shaping the world around us? This raises profound questions about the nature of consciousness and its role in the universe. The discovery of Zeta-9 forces us to reconsider the boundaries between the physical and the mental, the tangible and the intangible. It opens up new avenues of research and philosophical inquiry, challenging us to rethink what we know about the universe and our place within it. As we continue to study Zeta-9, we may uncover deeper truths about the fabric of reality. This particle could be the key to unlocking mysteries that have puzzled scientists and philosophers for centuries. The journey to understand Zeta-9 is just beginning, and it promises to be a fascinating exploration of the unknown. The journey to understand Zeta-9 is just beginning, and it promises to be a fascinating exploration of the unknown. With each experiment we move closer to unraveling the secrets of this enigmatic particle and its connection to our consciousness. The future of quantum research is bright, and Zeta-9 stands at the forefront of this exciting frontier. The future of quantum research is bright, and Zeta-9 stands at the forefront of this exciting frontier. As we delve deeper into the mysteries of this particle, we may find answers to questions we never thought to ask. The potential for discovery is limitless, and the implications for our understanding of reality are profound. The potential for discovery is limitless, and the implications for our understanding of reality are profound. Zeta-9 challenges us to expand our minds and explore the boundaries of what we know. It invites us to imagine a world where consciousness and quantum mechanics are intertwined, and where the possibilities are as vast as the universe itself. Zeta-9 challenges us to expand our minds and explore the boundaries of what we know. It invites us to imagine a world where consciousness and quantum mechanics are intertwined, and where the possibilities are as vast as the universe itself. The anticipatory particle is not just a scientific discovery, it is a gateway to a new understanding of reality. To study this perplexing phenomenon, scientists devised intricate experiments. These experiments were not just any ordinary tests, they were meticulously planned and executed with the utmost precision. The goal was to delve deep into the mysteries of the human mind and its potential connections to the quantum world. Volunteers were hooked up to EEG machines. These machines, equipped with advanced technology, were capable of capturing the minutest electrical impulses generated by the brain. The volunteers, a diverse group of individuals, were carefully selected to ensure a wide range of data. These machines monitored their brain activity with high precision. Every flicker of thought, every moment of contemplation was recorded and analyzed. The data collected was vast and complex, requiring sophisticated algorithms to interpret. The subjects were then presented with a series of choices, each with two options. These choices were designed to be simple, yet thought-provoking, ensuring that the participants had to engage deeply with the task at hand. As the participants contemplated their decisions, something remarkable occurred. The EEG machines began to pick up patterns that were previously unnoticed. These patterns seemed to indicate a pre-decision phase, a moment when the brain was gearing up to make a choice. Zeta-9, observed in a controlled environment, began to align its behavior with the choice the subject would eventually make. This alignment was not just a coincidence, it was a consistent pattern observed across multiple trials and participants. This was observed even before the subjects were consciously aware of their own decision. The brain seemed to be making choices on a subconscious level, with the conscious mind only catching up later. This revelation was groundbreaking, challenging our understanding of free will and decision-making. The implications were clear, our minds were interacting with the quantum world in ways we were only beginning to understand. The boundary between the physical and the mental was becoming increasingly blurred, suggesting a deeper connection between consciousness and the fabric of reality. These experiments provided concrete evidence of a link between human consciousness and the quantum realm. The data was irrefutable, showing a consistent pattern of interaction that could not be easily dismissed. The results challenged the long-held belief that consciousness is a mere byproduct of brain activity. Instead, they suggested that consciousness might play a more active role in shaping our reality, 
influencing events at a quantum level. Instead, Zeta-9 suggested that consciousness might be a fundamental force in the universe, capable of interacting with and influencing the fabric of reality. This idea, while still in its infancy, opened up new avenues of research and exploration, promising to revolutionize our understanding of the mind and the universe. Breaking the Thought Barrier The phenomenon observed in these experiments was dubbed the Thought Barrier. It seemed that our thoughts, often considered intangible and confined to the realm of the mind, were capable of crossing over into the quantum realm. This had profound implications for our understanding of the relationship between consciousness and the material world. Imagine a wall separating our thoughts from the physical world. Zeta-9 appears to effortlessly bypass this barrier. This challenges the traditional separation between mind and matter. Could it be that consciousness is not limited by the physical constraints we once believed? The thought barrier, once a theoretical concept, became a tangible phenomenon thanks to Zeta-9. Its existence opened up new avenues of exploration into the nature of consciousness and its influence on the universe. This discovery forced the scientific community to reconsider its assumptions about the relationship between the observer and the observed. The Mind's Energy Theories attempting to explain this connection between mind and Zeta-9 began to emerge. Some physicists propose that thought itself is a type of field. Just as gravity and electromagnetism permeate space, perhaps thought too, has a presence that extends beyond the confines of the brain. This field, they argued, interacts with quantum systems like Zeta-9. This interaction allows for the exchange of information, explaining how our thoughts could influence the particle's behavior. Imagine the human mind as a broadcasting station, sending out signals that ripple through the fabric of reality. This radical concept challenged the materialist view of the universe, suggesting that consciousness might be a fundamental property of the cosmos. Could it be that our thoughts, far from being confined to our heads, are constantly shaping the world around us at a quantum level?